battle continued and spread into the town itself. Before long, so many arrows had struck into Richard's armor that he looked like a porcupine. He was completely surrounded by the enemy, one against the multitude, and yet he emerged from a pile of dead unscathed. An emir on a richly comparisoned horse and frustrated at Richard's flair, genius, and almost supernatural skill in battle, charged the king, only to have not only his head but half his shoulder and right arm sliced off with it. The Muslim fighters recoiled at this ghoulish sight. As the day wore on, they gave Richard a wide berth, for the king had become a one-man killing machine. He had personified his name. He was the Lionheart.